Okay guys, so I'm back with today with another Doki Mail video. Jumping right in, I don't want to spend too long on this though, but we did find Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta's info. We have a new Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, and in case you've been looking at our watch, we have a new Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, he is incoming to Doken. Again, I'll try to upload this video as soon as I can, um, because then I'll kind of wait like a day to upload it, because I want to make sure the video is good for you guys and stuff like that, because little stuff like that, I like to kind of like nitpick around. They want video 60 frames per second, make it smooth, sickly for you guys. So I just said that, you know, being a girl put up mess up. It's not a girl put up mess in my opinion, but still. Yeah, this is the teaser for him and stuff like that. We got full teaser for him. We got break him down. We got a one more new unit as well coming with him. So we have a new good guy Nova. So yeah, he yeah he is actually a good like really a super hero, uh, not superhero, but yeah like a hero. Um, he is a superhero. Um, a hero. Um, um, Nova. The first one was kind. Which I'm kind of glad they did this though. Again, I have a lot to talk about in this video. Lots of good points I want to make. So much. So, yeah. Oh boy! So yeah, we got the full teaser for him and stuff like that right here in the game. Looking nice, looking crispy, looking clean. Of course, still with background. I'm about to do that for my thumbnail, you know, make him black some of that. Yeah, sneak big boys. But yeah, um, um, I'm gonna make them know beforehand anyway, though, so it doesn't really matter. It's like not a sneak peek, but this. Yeah, we have a new Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta and Kunda Doken. We gotta do them in the rock. It's it's only been like a week for Vichan because again, oh no, because he's almost the end of the I don't think I end up saying this for the beginning of the month, but I can't remember because Vichan usually takes a little bit longer. I don't know if it, this is probably the fastest unit we got because you know video was like almost like a week ago when I uploaded that video, so it's kind of weird. We were kind of getting more ready, but again, in a month they always kind of do this. I guess it could be for Halloween time slot, or no, because Frieza um has coolest time slot from last year, and the year before that even was AGM medical. So again, this guy is no, because I mean Jeffy's doing like two dual two dual dual fests in a row. Because Frieza was October. I gotta go back and see that. Yeah, because Frieza definitely was October. Or, um, how you September? How you want to pronounce it? So yeah, um, I guess it's gonna be like Halloween. Um, because I know we got Kenny Vegeta like right on Halloween. Cause I remember I did do him when he came out and stuff like that. I did his video when he came out. So yeah. Um, of course they have a new Infinite Dragon Ball stage. I think it's gonna be Shadow Dragon Saga or GT thing. I can't remember which one. But yeah, I am kind of glad though because again, it's been years since we got GT content. I don't want to go over that as well. We have a new Great Vegeta. They did make this as he jumped um in the 55th episode of GT. It's gonna be a free play Vegeta that goes to Great Eight, which hopefully have a good Great chance. But that book will not sucked. Um, hopefully he'll be good stuff like that. I know he has new medals, so I think the Shadow Dragon Saga um stage will update so you can get this guy plus we'll get equipment for it as well. I did read up on that a little bit. But yeah, all these models look like they're all new. Um I feel like from older events but now it's like supposed to be like Vegeta because he goes um you know basically like, um it's like him and during the work when you're talking about Goku, you're number one the whole Kakarot thing. Um is I think it's supposed to be like another version of that, just a GT version of him, but we got short hair Vegeta though. So it's shoot, I think it's Vegeta, like, you know, GT grade 8. So you can't do this SSR and TUR, which is good. Um, Lily does attack and defense plus 60%, and, um, I don't know, um, I didn't, um, I guess it could be like a Shadow Dragon Saga support, maybe? I don't know. Um, he's gonna be in that category though, because it's him in the Shadow Dragon Saga. I think he's like a taking a shower or something like that, he's working out. Oh, while Goku, um, is fighting Super, uh, Super Saiyan 4 Goku is fighting Nova, like, the battle fight again. Um, this is Vegeta basically, um, you know, kind of going over his life, and stuff like that, a little bit. Um, just basically kind of going over, so talking about his, um, little stuff. So I'm about shirt down like this. Um, again, I've been losing weight so much lately, so all these shirts look kind of really big on me now. So if you can, if you can tell the difference, like from like last time, because I did it to go back a few months ago, taking all, 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 all my other videos. It's like, yeah, man, I lost a lot of weight. I can definitely tell I lost a lot. Um, just stuff like that. Again, little stuff. I don't know, just little stupid stuff like that, kind of bring you know. If you guys care, you guys are like, I don't care. Get into the video. But I'm kidding though. I'm kidding. But yeah, like I said though, um, this new GT pre pre play GT Vegeta. He will, he will be doki looking into a um. um of course, a great Vegeta. Again, they mentioned this in VJP already. So, yeah, again, a lot of people don't really care, but they do mention this in VJP as well. So, that's pretty cool. Um, again, new units stuff like that. Again, I think it's hard new. So, it looks like the Shadow Dragon Saga story event will be updating right here. And they, I think they do also mention equipment down here somewhere. Um, I don't really see it like that, though. But it's like, eh, whatever. Oh, I, oh, I can scroll down. I guess I can really scroll down before. But, yeah. I like that here that mentioned like equipment and stuff like that. You can get equipment and plus, I guess, a stage will update so you can do it. Because this is like, kind of like the finale of GT ish. I'm like another new stage, I guess. It's like, okay, oh yeah, it's over. But let's add it. Let's add it. Let's add it. Let's add it to these GT DMs. But yeah, again, it's been like years. It's been like about a good almost quarter, two years now since we got GT content. Because the four year version really makes sense, you know, Super Saiyan 4, 4, 4, 4. four. Um, That's the last time we got GT content. Other than before that, we got nothing after that. Like, seriously, we got like, no GT content after that. So yeah. I'm um, a little bit hot because why am I um, so like the heat, the weather's starting, weather's starting to kind of heat up slash kind of cool down. The body kind of like remove, remove, remove like, you know, lighting background because it was kind of okay a little bit. But yeah, 
Um, of course, so we said for Vegeta, he is, he is an int type, which I'm kind of glad they did. I won't go with his but it looks like he does a lot, though. But yeah, he's int, and I was just cool. I was like, kind of just makes sense because it's like orange, you know, red outline. But yeah, still looks pretty good, though, honestly. I do like it, though. I'm glad his int makes sense because his orange was tech. I had, I had the same thing with Ink Gogeta because, you know, um, you know, Ink Gogeta and SDR Janepa, you know, before Gogeta was SDR, Gita, um, um, before, um, Gogeta was, um, um, the SCR Gogeta, you know, SCR Gogeta, um, each number, then they just switched to having Zeron next celebration, they did the same thing, copy and paste it with, um, for the anniversary, I guess they're kind of doing it here as well. I'm kind of glad that we are getting new GT content, I'm so glad though, I'm freaking finally glad they are doing this, because, oh my boy. I actually do like GT, a lot of people don't really, um, like it, but, I don't know, I, I, I did grow up watching it, a lot of people did love, um, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, like, the best thing that came out of GT, I gotta admit though, Pan was annoying as heck, I gotta, I can't, I gotta admit that, because I did really, because around the time when, um, GT was, um, not no, because when I was like a little kid, when I was starting to get into Dragon Ball, my friends are uh, studying Dragon Ball. Um, GT was actually one of those um, things like um, I kind of just saw and stuff like that. So I was like, okay, we'll watch it. It's like, nah, it's okay. But yeah, um, a little brief history. Of course, we are getting a new level right here. He is physical. Seems like it. So it makes sense, you know, Kelly and Vegeta and stuff like that. Vegeta and stuff like that. So yeah, I love his art though. His art's really awesome. And I think it'd be, it looks like his red shell form. I, I know like, we don't really watch GT. Um, he did actually did, it's basically Nova in like a red shell, like from before he cracks and goes golden. You know, the, 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 um, you know, before Gordon Freeze became a thing. So yeah, um, you go to Freeze before Gordon Freeze even became a thing. So yeah, um, I love people thinking they should be artificial life forms because, you know, Shadow Dragons are chicken and like, you know, artificial beings, which does make sense because they are basically, you know, um, it's been, been, been a big complaint. I think Truth actually mentioned that, like, you know, they should be like, you know, on artificial life forms. Um, that does kind of make sense of, because of course they are, you know, um, completely separate people. Um, they aren't like human or whatever. Um, that could be like Frieza though. I mean, isn't Frieza like produced or something like that? Because they didn't carry Toriyama like eventually confirm that Frieza like, you know, produced and stuff like that. I know, something like that. But yeah. Uh, so for good yeah, he, he does, um, for his new leader skill, he does great eight power on key three, everything up on 140, 170, or Shadow Dragon Saga. Key three, everything up on 50. I'm so glad they're doing Shadow Dragon Saga. They needed it. Like, they, again, that team is dead. No one wants physical Omega anymore. So yeah. Other people will be running the foot, like, floating the front with this Goji, you know? Yeah, graded power. It could be probably, like, all people who have, like, graded and stuff like that. I, I can't vote the category because I don't think it's live in the game just yet. But yeah. Super tag does Big Bang, um, Big Bang Kamehameha, Big Bang Kamehameha. Greater raise attack and defense for one turn, causes immense damage. Pretty good. Um, so attack and defense was 200. Holy crap, man. He's probably doing a crack. He has additional key plus 4 and attack and defense plus 40%. And effective against all types for 8 turns, which is good. From his first appearance, high chance of, um, I did as effective against all types um, from the ninth turns from the first from his first appearance. High chance of evading enemies attacks or encountering missile attacks. His active skill, his active skill is plus energy um ex 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 commission ex commission. Um, we basically that's what we did with um um I think he did with Nova um no um Omega. Or basically he um he took like a negative karma of all the attack he used in Dokken. He kicked it in the atmosphere and made, like, he put his he put his positive energy like he, he like he was so like you know. Um, Gogeta had so much energy, like, I think, like, from Korra and stuff like that, specifically. Um, where basically, when he kicked it, he had so much uh, positive energy, um, flowing through it, so he kicked it into space and stuff like that. He got rid of, like, all the negative energy surrounding the Earth. So, yeah, pretty good, though, for him, though. Pretty simple stuff. Um, so I guess, um, what's, yeah, conditions, um, um, be able to use, um, by, after receiving four more attacks. So basically, he's, um, a mini version of LRG in a sense, only once. So you're gonna see, yeah, definitely see his active skill and stuff like that, and so Battle Road. Maybe Super Battle Royale, like, again, he's, he basically is like Jiren on crack, kind of. Jiren, like a joke of physics, Jiren, essentially, so yeah. Um, the great power, again, probably like all great apes and stuff like that, um, is weird, because again, when they introduced like a new category with a new joke of physics unit, it does kind of suck, because we, you know, we just had Frieza, we can't pick up other world warriors and resurrected warriors. Um, and then before that, we had like Gohan and stuff like that, kind of, where we had like a new category, and then he had like, um, you know, a side category above it, that was really good, like Tyra Sands and Saviors. Um, so I guess the next joke of physics unit, Probably like what? No, because no, because do duck fetch will, will usually be at the end of the um, year. We we'll have like you know they'll show up like do clad figures and stuff like that. Because they did be mentioned Super Saiyan Four Vegeta, but he wasn't gonna be like you know GTD wasn't gonna be popping in a press I guess that's uh, kind of correlating to this one, but even though his arms are in the cross pose like the other clad figures, there are different like types of different clad figures and stuff like that. But overall, pretty simple, pretty easy. Again, two hundred attack and defense is gonna be amazing. Plus he himself keen a lot. So yeah, and attack defense is gonna keep going up. He's gonna be effective against all types. No, I mean his attack defense is gonna you know pretty go up substantially. Um, 
And of course, he, he's going to be effective because he also has eight turns, or he has a high chance of it doing gear for nine turns. Of course, counter attacks makes sense. I did see some, a little bit of his um, animation, like preview and stuff like that. It looks really amazing. I haven't seen it at all yet, though. I won't be uploading to the channel, though. So, a typical Gogeta links and stuff like that Super Saiyan, Kamehameha, Shocking Speed, Orange Flash, GT, Fuse Fighter, and Fifth Battle. Really good. Again, with the link system nowadays, it's going to be good. So, he has great power, Fusion, um, Shadow Dragon Saga, Kamehameha, and Final Trump Card. Really amazing categories. Again, he's going to be good for all this. When we get Elder Gogeta, he's basically going to be this guy, correct? And he's kind of like Jiren and stuff like that, essentially like a Joker Fest um, tech LR Jiren. Basically, put him in a Joker Fest. And this is what you kind of get. He's pretty good though, really simple, really easy. I'm so glad they're doing this. Again, every good is going to be effective against all types. This is where I have every good Gogeta card in the game. Um, when this guy comes out, you know, he, he can probably be back on Joker Joker Fest banners. I'm going to probably end up pulling him. Again, if you have a whole bunch of Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta to tech one, defeat him to this guy. I'm getting not going to replace the tech one, even though, you know, tech one's outdated, but he still is good. He has unfortunately aged a little bit. Um, but yeah, they didn't make this guy too much. Um, like that, I guess they've come into the tech power part, but yeah. They got a new Nova Shaman. I mean, actually, he's a good guy, Nova, so you can run him. Uh, no, you can't run him and the other one together because they have the same name. So he's a Shadow Dragon Saga key for everything up 120. That's amazing. Good again. Buffing Shadow Dragon is the, amazing because, again, I feel like they should, they were really probably make an overall GT category, but it's like, yeah. Um, Raid Stack attack for three turns, it causes miss damage and still super attack, like all the other Shadow Dragons, like Oceans does. Again, good buff for Shadow Dragons. We need them to be a category. So he does attack defense plus 140. Um, and attack defense, and attack defense is um, 40%, gains a high chance of being critical when um, fighting against stream class enemy. Um, again, he would really probably want to use him for super battle road, it's gonna be really good there for like the heroes and stuff like that. He gains additional attack defense plus um, additional key to an attack defense plus 40%. It was a shadow dragon, um, shadow dragon, um, saga, um, category enemy, shadow dragon saga category, um, um, allies, um, defense plus 40%. So this is our gentleman, um, Cold Judgment, Shocking Speed, GT, Shell Dragon, um, Revival, and Fierce Battle. Again, he's not really good gel like that, except besides the GT links, but again, GT has got a really good update with the link system, so that's really good. So he does, um, so the category of Shell Dragon, Resurrected Warriors, and for the Revival. Oh, he's on Resurrected Warriors, that's gonna be really good for him though, but... I get prison does leave that category off, and you know, he kind of makes it up with the whole line units a little bit, but yeah. Um, yeah, that does make sense, because when, um, you guys know, if you guys know the context of Nova, um, of the Nova right here, um, I'll scoop him up. Of Nova, um, Goku and GT, he ate the Dragon Ball, he ate the Four Star Ball, which had Nova, like, you know, um, he ate the Four Star Ball. And, um, he, um, he, I think Goku had so much other energy inside him and stuff like that, you know, Nova came back alive and stuff like that. So that's really good. Again, they should have a transforming version of him later, like, you know, with the red shell form. I thought they would get to do this guy, make him like a transformation, like, you know, a couple of turns, you know, because he did take, a, he did take a long time to actually transform into the golden form or something like that. But yeah. Well, that's simple stuff. Again, he's like a mini Gogeta kind of VI yeah, and him coming out with, um, again. I think, I think they're trying to split up like Room of Gods, like have a good um guy, or have a good and evil like, you know, Shadow Dragon like Saga thing. Because again, you know, Room of Gods is really good, and Hero Room of Gods is really good as well. Because they're trying to probably GFVH eat it a little bit though, but again, really simple update, really good stuff. Again, they made this guy pretty good. Again, they didn't make him overly broken, nothing special like that, but again, Gogeta is pretty simple. I like it, they didn't make him too broken like Frieza, they made him really simple. He's like, not at the best though, Frieza unit, but his banner is still pretty, pretty good. Again, it's a good time I was thinking they could put a lot of Super Saiyan, um, the LR, um, Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Vegeta on there, but I doubt it. They're not going like, to do that, just to beat people in it. Otherwise, it'd be like 11 or 10 years on that banner anyway, though. So, yeah, again, they could do it. They did that with the, um, the, um they did it with um, Angel Goku and Angel Vegeta. And the, the, even though the banner sucked, Angel Goku and Angel um, Vegeta, the banner sucked. But yeah, that was pretty solid, though. Of course, you didn't get crit and stuff like that for, um, if you're fighting an enemy. So, basically, you might go for a digital first guy. And on top of that, you're going to be critting a lot if you're fighting a lot of enemies, which, again, there's not, there's not that many villains in the game like that, but again, pretty good for Battlefield. He's gonna be really good for Battlefield. Um, again, critting and stuff like that's gonna be really good. Give himself key, a lot of good attack and defense. I think he's gonna be pretty solid as well. Again, with the link system update nowadays, he's gonna be looking amazing, more amazing than Presser. But yeah, he's gonna do really simple stuff like that. They didn't make him too broken. They didn't make him, um, again, they didn't make him too much like that. But yeah, a real simple stuff, of course. Like I said, um, Again, really good update. I'm glad, I'm glad they're doing GT stuff again. Um, again, like it's following that Inko Jita path kind of, you know, where he, you know, then when they, um, um, you know, made, like, it's basically uh, a nowadays version of him, you know, better animations. That's why I consider it as a nowadays unit, better animations. Um, slight tweaks here and there. Um, makes animations good. Again, ma makes some good slight, slight tweaks here and there, and that's really pretty much it. But yeah, gonna go ahead and end the video here. Hope I didn't make it too long. But yeah, really simple stuff for this guy, though. Again, made him really simple, made him really easy to, um, and stuff like that. Didn't make him too broken. Okay, he's like LR Jiren, just a joke because version of LR Jiren. But if it's all types, countering and stuff like that, again, the counter animations looking good. Basically, with like Vegeta, uh, Super Vegeta, they learn from that. 
again, amazing though. Yeah, again, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, really hyped. Again, I just really can. I feel like they could do something again, December slash November. They could do Dragon Ball Hero stuff in November. I feel like they could be global crossover and stuff like that. Could be. Um, you know, because last year was stuff like that, we already got heroes from last year, you know, Goku and Jimmy could do something together in November. It seems like they are kind of saying, you know, because Vegeta just kind of came out of nowhere, because he's nowhere in, in, like, he's nowhere in the celebration for Halloween at all. So, again, they're probably just something that, and they did before, they had, like, a double fetch unit and something in the celebration. But, like, okay, yeah. But, yeah, Vegeta will we'll just update to his event. So, yeah, again, made him in, really simple, stuff like that. Really, um, easy to get and stuff like that. Hopefully, um, you know. Still look for you guys if you're something like The banner will probably be trash anyway, though. Just saying, they've done this before. I mean, if the banner was good, then they're gonna make a trash banner. They'll have like, you know, a couple of units that are not on the banner again. Wait for them to come back, wait for them to come to you. And if it's gonna be good as well, again, it's gonna be on your banner moving forward. So, yeah, like I said, nowadays, just you can probably just easily skip these banners again. I might make a video when it comes out, but we don't know when it's gonna come out. Halloween, probably highly. Highly, probably Halloween. See you guys later, though. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Great life. All cool junk again, though. Um, but yeah, made it simple, shows the point, I like it though. They didn't make him too busted, I'll keep going to the plane. They didn't make him busted, he's jumping the best human in the game. Where's the stuff like that? So yeah, see you guys later though, again though.